Hello everyone, welcome to Ortho Implants for Life. Today we will discuss about external fixator fixation procedure. So let's begin. To start with, we will first take the triple trocker. It has got three components. This one is the protection sleeve that guards the soft tissues. This one is the drill guide and this is the trocker. So we have to insert the drill guide inside the tissue protector and then take the trocker and drill through the drill guide. If the surgeon decides to use an external fixator in order to fix the tibia shaft fracture. First, we will use a 3.2 mm drill bit. After this, we remove the drill bit along with the drill guide. And then we will take a 4.5 mm sun spin. We will attach the 4.5 mm sun spin in the T-handle with chuck and then use the key to tighten this sun spin in the T-handle. Thereafter, we will take the sun spin and insert it through the protection sleeve with the help of the T-handle chuck with key attachment. Once the sun spin is inserted, we remove the T-handle chuck. We also remove the protection sleeve and the sun spin stays back. Next, we take the single pin clamp and we insert the sun spin through this pin fixator. Once inserted, we will tighten the nut with the help of the spanner we have. Next, in this hole, we will be inserting the tubular rod. This is the tubular rod. Once you have aligned the tubular rod, we will have to do the final tightening with the help of the spanner on this nut. Now when the fracture is near the condyle part or the cancellous part like near the ankle region in such case we will use the cancellous pin as you can see the threads are bigger in the cancellous pin now let us understand the use of the transverse clamp this is used to fix fractures near the calcaneum region which is basically condyle part of the bone. We can provide pin on both the sides in different angles. We can insert the pin through this hole. and we can adjust the angle accordingly. Same goes for the other side of this transverse clam as well.
once you fix it in the desired angle you can lock this pin by tightening this nut and you can lock the transverse clamp in the tubular rod by tightening this nut see this one is straight on the other hand this one is this one is pointing in a different angle you can fix another pin in the other end of the transverse clamp you can adjust the distance of the pin from the fracture side by adjusting this nut Now let us understand the fixation procedure for tube to tube external fixator. We will take the tube to tube clamp, fix it in the tubular rod. This part is adjustable. So you can fix another tubular rod in different angle like this. This is sometime also used to extend or connect another rod in the external fixator Both these type of clamps are used if the fracture is near the condyle region or near the joint region of the bone That's all for today If you've enjoyed the video like it share it If you're new to our channel subscribe it Hit the bell icon to get the notifications for our upcoming videos. If you have any queries, comment below and we will surely reply back. If you want to know more about career prospects in orthopedic implant industry and wish to start a career in orthopedic implant industry, please click the link below in the description box and DM us to know more. Thank you and see you in our next video.